In this video, I will show you how to make online changes in S7 for a CFC logic. Well, I'll go to the plant view and a specific PLC logic. And for example, I'm going to open this uh, CFC chart of a belt conveyor and I'll go to the particular section C drive block. So this is the belt conveyor drive block. I will and change it to test mode and uh, make an observation and online observation by clicking on the spectator type button. Now I want to make some modification to my logic and uh, I'll show you how to download that modified program without stopping the PLC. So as you can see that the ABM or load interface of the C drive block. I am going to make any uh, some some changes to it. I will connect it to my end block. Well, the program has now been modified, and uh, without stopping the PLC, and subsequently without stopping the process, because stopping a PLC means stopping the process. To avoid that, I'll download the changes only in the S seven four hundred PLC, and for that I am going to click on the download button and uh, over here it is asking for a compilation because compilation comes before downloading so I click yes and then I will click on the changes only remember changes only is the option that will not make the PLC to go into the stop mode if you click on the entire program in that case the PLC will be stopped and hence the process will be stopped so this is the one of the best options in a sound for PLC that we can make online changes in as in the PLC program you will have to wait for some time it may take a minute or a half Well, the compilation has been started. Remember the changes only option. The download to CPU changes only is in progress. So this window will pop up once the download process has been complete. It will show you the errors and warnings. And now thus in this way, the changes have been applied in the PLC program and once you go online you can see that the changes have taken place in the PLC program so that's it for now see you in the next so this is how we make online changes to a 7400 PLC logic the logic was in CFC of course as you can see the drive block was modified and the changes were applied to the PLC program without stopping the PLC. So that's it for now. Please subscribe to my channel and for more videos just like this about CMAT, about Semantic PCS7 and PLC programming in general, subscribe to my channel and see you next time.